Hello everybody and welcome to the Disabled Team. Hope everybody's doing well. Um, new updates emerged that um, um, Leeds United and Salem Rementio are in continuing talks over a transfer for Leo Yelda with the Whites keen to strike a loan to buy deal as per um, Italian outlet Tutto Salem Rementio. I'm going to share the screen so you can see this. Um, former Celtic youngster Ye Yelder has, made, has been on a book settle and road since signing from the boys in, t in August 2021. The Norway Under-21 international could be on the move again, though amid interest from Italy. Salentino was said to be in talks with the 19-year-old no no um, Norwegian in a report via Sky Sports. Um, um, on um, the 28th of um, June um, last month. Um, however, Salentini's initial approach for a loan seems not to have met um, with Leeds United's liking. The Whites preferring a permanent move, a deal. Some of the Enter were not willing to do the business this way and instead um, proposed a loan with a purchase option. Um, now, though, things seem to have changed according to Tutiana San Lorenzo, the West Yorkshire club are willing to take a small step back, but Leeds United are insisting that the option becomes an obligation. Leeds United are said to be looking for a payment of €2 million, um, Euro, which is £1.7 million, pound, in order to get Yelder off the books at Ellen Road, but also with an attached percentage of on the resale. Tutu Salenio state that they could um, be quick movement on the deal, which they say could go through as early as next week. So, um, Yelder on the move. Um, Yelder was highly thought of at Celtic, and he is in, highly thought of at Leeds United. However, needs must and relegation to the Championship means that certain players will be on the move. Yelder appears to be one of these. Last season, the talented 19-year-old featured in 12 matches in a championship for um, Rotherham United. He made the Premier League match day squad a number of times for Leeds United. Over the night, his appearances have mainly been for the Whites in the Premier League 2 competition. He is a versatile player, um, um, equally at home as a left-sided central defender or pushed further as a left-back. He is strong in the tackle, as well as being good on with the ball at his feet. Skilled um, in the Bielsa style of football, he is capable of bringing the ball out from the back. Um, for such a small outlet, um, so Salamantina um, could have a good player on their books. Leeds United's insistence of a real sale clause is sensible. It is something that they have used before via... Um, Ella Capri's transfer to Bari. This decision, this was a decision that could pay dividends for the Whites. Um, Capri recently um, been bought by Napoli. Um, so that's the story, guys. And I'd be really sad to see him yelled to go. But, but if it means bringing in some money to um, improve the, the squad um, in the transfer window for Leeds United's benefit, I think we have to do it. And I thought I said this before, we need to start bringing money into the club. Um, it doesn't matter whether the 49ers said the price is limited or £6 billion, pound, um, valued at £6 billion. The problem is, if you can't balance your books, you're in a bit of trouble. So we need to show, we need to show that, you know, when we as we're buying players, we're, we're making money um, that we're selling players. And at this moment in time, we just... Not doing that, are we? Um, so yeah, it's um, it's just one of them things, guys. It's one of them things, and I think, I think if, you know, if it means bringing any money, I'm sorry to say this, but um, thank you for your services, Yelda. Um, but um, you know, you go with our blessing. But yeah, let us know what your comments, what you think, guys. Do you think this is a good, good move or a bad move by Leeds United? Be interesting to see what you've got to say. Um, yeah, so yeah, um, thank you very much for watching this edition of Disabled Team. Really, really do appreciate it.
um, your support, guys. Really, really do. Um, I know I ain't got my green screen down. It's I've got, I'm going to have to put it back on a run on its runner. I think um, it's been up and down that much. So yeah, look. Um, I don't know if we're gonna get. I don't know if we're gonna wait out over weekend or out. If we do, I'll um jump on. If we don't, I won't. Does that make sense? But yeah, um, thank you very much for watching this edition of Table Team, guys. And until next time, there's only one thing left to say. Um, it's a goodbye from me, guys. Take care. Bye bye.